Can I speak with you? Amen. Say amen. Amen. Say amen. Amen. Stand up, Mama. Thank you, Jesus. Can I speak with you? Yes, please. Can I speak with you? Yes, please. I saw a place called Mbangi. Yes. Correct. Huh? Correct. Yes. And when I'm there, I'm looking at a church. Yes. Huh? Yes. Amen. So when I'm looking at this church, there's hey. no growth. Yes. Nothing at all. Huh? Nothing yes. at all. And I heard there's a spirit yes. that is turning around your house. This is a spirit of sickness. Yes. Correct. Are you with me? Amen. So I want to pray for you. God is going to help you today. Amen. And whatever that you've been crying for, God is going to do it. Amen. Amen. I'm telling you, because I saw... <laughs> After we pray for you, God is going to anoint you Amen. to go and pray for other people. Amen. Amen. Because people, they think pastors can't face challenges. It's not true. That's yes. true. It's only when you realize your challenge, you go away this higher anointing. Amen. Amen. That's why people are running to Nigeria. Amen. Correct. Not that they are not anointed, mm. but because someone must pray for you. Amen. I want to pray for you. Amen. And God is going to help you. Amen. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because I saw sugar diabetes. Correct. Huh? Correct. From sugar diabetes, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a hypertension. Correct. Huh? Correct. On you, I'm seeing hypertension. Yes. But on the other side, I'm seeing something like a cholesterol. Yes. Yes. Huh? Yes. I'm going to pray for you. Amen. Already this anointing that you've been crying for. Amen. God is going to raise your church. Amen. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Amen. And I'm telling you, from here, God will give you the grace of praying for people that are sick. Amen. Amen. Because you people, you are suffering with this. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Amen. Because here, already I'm feeling your kidneys. Amen. Huh? Amen. I'm feeling some pains here at the back. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. Mm. So don't know what he said. You are healed today. Amen. Amen. You are healed. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, my tinning. Jesus, my tinning. This thing is starting to affect your eyes. Yes. Huh? Yes. I'm seeing struggling a lot. A lot, yes. This, is, this sugar, it won't kill you. Amen. Are you hear me? Amen. Because this has been the problem of the family. Yes. Huh? Correct. This is a disease of the whole family. Correct. Are you hear yes. me? Yes. After we pray for you, you must go and pray for them. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Sometimes your stomach become bloated. Yes. Huh? Yes. And you don't even know what the cause. And now this thing is like sometimes it's making you to lose appetite. Yes. Huh? Yes. But after I pray for you, God is going to heal you. Huh? Amen. Don't worry, you and your husband, you'll make it. Amen. And don't worry about just children. Yeah. Don't worry about them. Because Thank you. Satan is also trying to use these children. Yes, yes, you know what I mean? yes. Because the reason is always when Satan can't find something to do. Amen. He has to bring children. Yes. Now, some because it's like sometimes they don't listen to you people. Yeah, it's true. Don't. I'm hearing something like Abigail. Huh? Mama. huh? It's me. In Jesus' mighty name. 
Your people, you are free. Go and rejoice. My name is uh, Pastor Alfred Miyaka. I'm from uh, Mpangeni. Uh, and I'm with my dear wife, Abigail Miyaka, also a pastor. Well, the man of God has prophesied that uh, I've got uh, an hypertension, I've got a diabetes uh, through the family. It's a hereditary thing from our, from my father, grandfather, and all of us at home, brothers and sisters, we are suffered the same. And uh, I'm very much glad that uh, he said, um, as this uh, disease going away today, I will be the one who will be praying for them and taking this disease away because it's a generational curse. It's over five years now, so it, my vision is deteriorating. So, and uh, I can feel the, 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 the kidneys as well, that it's also starting to affect me. And the great thing is that uh, these diseases uh, were not meant to kill me but is to teach me that uh, God uh, can take away the diseases. So, and uh, the man of God says, I've, I've got a, a, a healing gift. So, by having this disease going away, so it means that uh, I'll, be have, I'll be having a proof that this thing can go away through prayer. Words of encouragement to the viewers? I would say, um, especially to pastors out there, if uh, uh, it needs to it needs be, we must have come and see the man of God, which has got a higher anointing than you, so that you will be also not be hindered with your ministry or or whatever calling God has called you for.